Hey guys, welcome to today's 16 Galaxies video. Today we're going to be taking a look at MMS 644, that being Electro from Spider-Man No Way Home. Um, so first of all, I'd like to thank Jefferson Tan uh, for sourcing this figure for me. While it's readily available at retail, Jefferson just had a price that uh, could not be beaten. So this was about 370 um, Australian, uh, so fantastic um, price uh, compared to that of um, Australian retail at the moment. Uh, so um, on the front of the box, we can see that we do have an art image of Electro. Uh, we can see the Goblin Bomb, we can see Doc Hawk Tentacle, uh, we can see he's got the um, electricity mask, which we'll talk about later. We can see that it says Spider-Man No Way Home Electro. Um, it is the classic slip style cover that we've gotten for a while. Um, this side just continues the art with the lightning and the um, strange portal coming out. You can see a couple of stills um, there in the light as well. Uh, the back of the box is just going to have all your logos and everything. The lightning continues, says Electro. Uh, and then this side here, the art once again continues. Um, so we are going to take a look at a couple of the accessories that the food comes with. Um, and then just because I am using, uh, just because I don't have the tripod, um, we'll take a look at the figure, how I've um, set him up. So, um, when you first get the figure, you are going to get a right and left fist on the figure. Um, I have removed that, so you can see um, sculpted uh, plastic, obviously, but the paint is fantastic, um, looking quite weathered. You can see that they are fingerless gloves. Um, get the other side. Yeah, the armor um, looks like armor, the gloves look like gloves, it's um, what we expect from toys. Um, we also get uh, this hand here, this kind of reaching out, um, gesturing hand, grabbing hand, whatever you want to call it. Um, so again, you can see the fingerless gloves, very nicely painted fingernails. Uh, we of course get that for the other side as well. Um, and then we have another um, set of hands that are quite similar to this but opposed um, ever so slightly different and we'll look at those in a sec. Um, you do get various lightning effects that I've already placed on the figure which we'll take a look at shortly um, and then we get the lightning mask itself um, which clips on quite easily, does look quite nice, translucent, see all the electricity effects. Um, I know probably a few people don't like this, but it is um, a really good nod to the comics that I really dig. Alrighty, let's see Max's upgrade. Um, so we can see the display stand. Spider No Way Home Electro, and we get an awesome picture there uh, for the lightning turned on, which is great. Uh, so you can see the other hand that I was talking about um, in kind of a lightning summoning slash gesturing hand. Um, but yeah, let's start with the sculpt. Um, I think it's a phenomenal, um, phenomenal sculpt, definitely. Definitely um, it looks like our actor. Um, so of course, it's um, Jamie Foxx. Um, if we get time, I will show the original design uh, for Electro as well, just to show that uh, both did have good likenesses to the actor. Um, so, this figure you can see has a lot going on. Um, so this light um, piece here, you just um, kind of stretch around over the torso and you can have it um, over the reactor. You can see that he's got wires coming over his suit. We've got armor there, it's coming down. Uh, it's a very mixed mash of different ideas that all um, uh, really do work.
Um, so just looking at the right, we can see that you've got the armor, you've got the shoes, cargo pants. Uh, the articulation for this guy is completely fine. I don't, um, there's there's no hindrance whatsoever. The pants um, do a really good job of that. In the back, you can see, um, again, all the wires and everything that he's used to create uh, this version of the suit. Um, so the... They are three separate effects, so you get this piece, the uh, corresponding piece, and then the uh, piece that does go over the torso section. And of course it is the dynamic flight stand. See the belt is very nicely weathered, the art reactor, um, and like I said that that sculpt um, is just crazy good. Uh, so I can't uh, demonstrate as I don't have the um, correct equipment, but there is, um, the instructions do show you how you can open up the back and there is a uh, plug for a USB cable. Uh, so you can have that um, light up effect as well. I'm just not going to demonstrate it here, but he does um, have it, uh, which is also um, a phenomenal uh, feature for him to have. So I'll just bring it forward a tad. Um, I do like that we do get the new style display stand as well. Uh, it just makes things a lot easier uh, when compared to this big old thing. Um, so we have the original um, design of Electro versus the new design of Electro. Um, obviously, it's going to be up to you as to which uh, one you prefer. Um, but both, that there definitely does have um, a likeness to how he appeared in The Amazing Spider-Man 2. Um, but overall, I, I just think... The new design uh, is a better design, and um, if we place um, this on him, uh, yes, it looks a little goofy, uh, but he did have a mask um, in the comics and in the 90s Spider-Man show that pretty much had the same shape um, as that. Uh, so I just think it's an overall nice design, and I mean, it's not permanent, so you can't just slide it off if you don't uh, like the full power-up look. Um, but yeah, overall, um, I just think that uh, this newer design uh, is a, a nicer figure to own. Um, and you're not going to have uh, some of the possible issues uh, like the flaking uh, that this one might get. Uh, mine hasn't had any flaking or anything, so that's really good. Um, both have light-up features, obviously. Um, he's got the blue lightning as opposed to the yellow lightning. Um, but yeah, I think um, using the different energy feel uh, multiverse was definitely a really good way to reset his appearance. Um, and yeah, I dig it. Anyway, guys, this has been a look at the... Uh, MMS 644 Electro and a very brief comparison to the Amazing Spider-Man 2 Electro. Um, hopefully you like the information in this video. Thank you for watching. Um, we will have a Hot Toys uh, Third Sister video um, later on as well. And then um, if I get time this weekend, I'll do the EXO Paris as well. Alright guys, thank you for watching.